Brothers and sisters, the celestial energy, brother wisdom. Okay, let's, uh, we, I want to go a little deeper into symmetry. I want to talk about the symmetry of uh, uh, the original people. Okay, I want to talk about the symmetry of us, the original people. All right. That um, verse about the five virgins um, was very good to explain symmetry. A lot of the ministers out there are not at that level where they can actually break this uh, uh, thing down and 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 uh, tell you what it's really talking about. All right, ministers out there can't do it. The preachers out there, the so-called evangelists and all that, they don't have that type of knowledge. All right, and they would never have that type of knowledge as long as they're tapping into that you know look as long as they're looking for 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 money and and all this um self-made clout or whatever but i want to talk about the symmetry of the original people all right like i was talking with a brother today i said you know you got to understand everything is within everything and i talked about this before you know fire is water water is fire all right and how is that so How's how's fire is water and water is fire? Fire is the fire is air, and air is fire. Fire is the planet and is 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 the ground. Fire is the dirt, and the dirt is fire. I mean, think about it. So when you have a fire and you put water on it, the water doesn't put the fire out. The water actually causes the fire to transition into water all right and the same thing you can have you've had there's been cases where water has caught on fire how is that possible because this all plasma all right that's the symmetry of it all the sim the, nat the natural order of uh, 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 uh of symmetry okay you could take the dirt off the ground and put it on top of the fire but does it actually put the fire out? No, because what happens? The fire transitions itself and now it becomes that dirt. The symmetry of it. All right. You understand? Do you understand the symmetry? All right. The air. Does the air actually put the fire out? Because when you look in uh, uh, in the storms in California, we get the, 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 the forest fires in California. They said there is fire in the air. They said the air has turned to fire. All right. That's the symmetry of it all. The same thing with water. You know, the same thing with, I mean, the, the natural order. You know, you have a lightning bolt, which is nothing but a plasma energy. And there's lightning that hits the trees and then the tree catch fire. All right. Now... When the tree caught fire, what happened? It's all plasma. The tree is plasma. The lightning bolt is plasma. The fire is plasma. Did the tree actually catch fire? No, the tree actually, when the lightning bolt hit the tree, the tree actually uh, 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 raises vibrations so high that it, would, it, it literally produced or emitted fire. So this symmetry is all one in the same. There are some trees around the planet that has an eternal fire on the inside of them and the fire never dies the fire is constant there's there's some trees that have a fire on the inside of them constantly they call that in the in that so-called bible the burning bush and these are trees that they burn they they constantly burn on the inside all day all night because it's all one in the same. It's all the symmetry of it all, the symmetry of nature. Now, if we get into ourselves and you go into your deep meditative state and you say, I feel this. It feels like lightning all over my body. It feels like lightning in my hands. It feels like fire in my hands. Some people say it feel like I got water in my hands. Some people say, well, it feel like air is in my hands. Say some people say, well, you know, I, I went into meditation and, and then I opened my hands and 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 look like it's little grains of, of of dirt or sand. And it's like I didn't get in the sand because we are part of nature. 
This is a symmetry of it. So when you're tapping into your higher self, which is the higher part of this lower self, which is that part that we to always be seeking after, all right? Got our people running after Jesus and, and, and God when we should be seeking after our higher selves, okay? And it's our higher selves, it's not, it's not Jesus and God that we running after, that we, that, that we should be running, like, like I said, it's our higher self. So when you go into a meditative state, what are you doing? You're, 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 you, the, 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 the thing that we should be doing right now is going to our higher self, you know, looking into a mirror darkly, all right? Looking into a mirror darkly, because when, because tonight, you know, I was on my break, I took the time and I and 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 I went I went seeking for my higher self. Now it's the time, guys, to seek for your higher self. And I went seeking for my higher self, and there I was looking at me, and me looking at uh, myself, looking at me, my higher self looking at my lower self, and my lower self looking at my higher self, and we saw each other eye to eye. All right. So the symmetry of it all is the fact that we are that very energy. We're the very nature. We are the, the wind. We are the water. We are the fire. We are the lightning. We are the planet. This is the symmetry of it all. All right? That's why it's important for us to have a hollow soul. The hollow soul brings forth the, the, the true nature of who we are. So you can go into that meditation and you said, dang, I felt lightning just, just hit, hit the top of my head. Yeah, you did. That was plasma energy. My hands are on fire. I go, I, I, I got wind. I can make it feel, feel like it's just wind everywhere. So this is the part, the, the symmetry part of us, the part of us that 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 is equal to the natural order of the nature around us so when i talked about the fire that actually the uh, uh transition to water when the water hit it or when you blow the fire out that you're not you're not stopping the fire only thing that fire do is doing is is no longer in the fire physical fire form it's in the form of air. It had transitioned over to air. And then what you have left over, you see the smoke, which is the evidence of the fire, the spirit of the fire. That's all. This is the evidence of the fire. So 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 this is this is who we are. We are all that. And that's an, it's important to understand the symmetry of our celestial energy bodies. It's important to understand the symmetry of who we are. All right. Now, when you go into the to your like what you say, your demonic forces or they're going to the satanic realm, what they call the satanic realm, the demonic forces. Now, what's happening is because you have tapped into your higher self. This your Dragon Ball Z, your x Men, your Superman, your Batman and all that. You have literally tapped into your higher self. OK. And by you tapping into your higher self, now what happens? That fire that that you felt, you just felt the heat of the fire, but the fire that you felt was literally coming out of your body. Okay. And this is the this is the key part. This is the key part within that symmetry of us. The fire comes out of your body, but it doesn't burn you. But it will burn your enemies. All right. The water that comes out of your body, you can make water. You see the symmetry of it all. We can create water out of nothing because we are the water of life. We create water out of nothing. And the water comes out of your body. It'll never drown you. You create water. You can you can hold, have a whole ocean. You can have a you can have a, a, a valley, and from you alone, you can make water come out of you and fill that valley up and you have a lake okay the wind you can make the wind come from your body and there it goes you go into the right state of mind and you close your hands and open your hand back up 
and there's a diamond. A stone created. This is the symmetry of who we are. This is important for higher self, the higher energy, higher knowledge. Tapping into that 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 most uh, 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 um, secretive place, which is is which is your, your your most inner self. This is the symmetry of it all. This is the symmetry of everything that we know. All right. This is this this is the symmetry of our so-called melanin bodies. We celestial energy beings because we are nature. As nature is who we are. So it's important to understand, you know, the reason why these orc beings want to take our organs and want to take our body parts because they know who we are. It's just our people haven't figured that out yet. It's our people who haven't figured out that, wait a minute, I'm nature. And I'm this and I'm that and I'm this. And our people haven't figured it out yet. All right. So it's important that we learn of the natural elements that's within us so that we can begin to create that force. All right. We can begin to create that force and create that energy. We have that ability to do so. So, but in order to do this, we can't do it alone in our lower self. So we need help from our higher self. So that's why it's important now. Now is the time that we begin to seek for our higher selves. The doors won't open until September. Okay, we all know that. No doors open until September, but we get ready to go into August. So now is the time now before September gets here that we tap into our higher selves so that we'll be prepared so that when 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 that time comes, we will be able to uh, 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 make the energy comes from our body. We'll be able to manifest that. It'll be able to we'll be able to manifest that in the physical form. All right. Because our higher selves and our lower selves will have joined together and we will have become one. So I just wanted to talk about the symmetry of the melanin bodies. You know how we are the same as nature and nature is the same as us. And how we have this same ability in our physical bodies that nature has in its spiritual self. OK, so um, uh, the dreams that we have, we just looking into our higher self. You know, brother says, you know, I, I felt these this this tingles all over me and I felt this um these these chills that was just vibrations. All right. Same way we can create ice. From our bodies. We create ice from our bodies just the same way we can create fire. All right. We can create a hot burning wind just like we can create a cool calming wind. All right. We can create raging waters just like we can create uh, 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 subtle waters. All right. That air we can create. I mean, I was saying that we can we can create earthquakes. All right. With our body, we can create earthquakes, make the make the ground shake. But at the same time, we can create nature and make trees grow. This is who we are. And this is the symmetry that I'm getting across is the fact that we are the same exact uh, makeup as nature. And this is why it's important for us to tap into our higher selves and to believe in the natural order within us. We're the sun, we're the moon, the magnetism. Like the like the 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 the, the character Magneto. You gotta understand the character Magneto Magneto. Magneto has the ability to 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 attract anything metal to his body. And we in our with our higher selves connected to us, we can do the same. 
because we are magnetic beings. Our soul is highly magnetic. That's why it's important to have a hollow soul, not having any feelings and emotions and and all these different uh, types of, um, of 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 mundane uh, uh, feelings. All right. So 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 just just wanted to, just wanted to embark on that. The symmetry of melanin. The symmetry of our melanin bodies, how we are the same as the nature around us. We're the exact same beings. There's a fire that that's burning within us. There's energy that's within us. That's so powerful. You can open up your hands and you can f and be like, wow, it feels like a whirlwind just flying through my hands. Then you can open up your hands at the same time, feel like fire is coming down or lightning is coming down. But at the same time, it feels like, like the ground, like boulders are pressing down, like a boulder is pressing down on your hand. The symmetry of the melanin beings. So it's important that we go into our meditative state and, and seek for higher self. You just go within yourself. You go into your meditation and you say, within, I'm seeking for my higher self. I'm, 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 I'm linking, not seeking. Let's not say seeking because that's like praying. Say, I am linking up with my higher self. I am linking up with my higher self that I may become one with my higher spiritual self. All right. Now, when you make that link, you're going to see yourself and the spirit around while your eyes close. You're going to see yourself and you may speak to you and, 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 and yourself will speak back to your to yourself. And a lot of times your, your higher self is looking like, OK, that's my lower self and won't say nothing at all. Because your higher self. While you are in your lower self, seeking to link up with your higher self, your higher self is seeking to link up with your lower self. So the two are within the same, doing the same thing, symmetry. Both of them are seeking to link up with each other so they can become one being. Which means that's total cosmic Balance the complete balance of the cosmos. This is the symmetry of it all. <laughs> all right, guys, that's about all I got for you right now. We'll talk a little later. Just wanted to talk about the symmetry of our melanin bodies. All right. All power to the multi chakra celestial energy beings. Peace to you all. Go into meditation. Seek for your higher self. All right. Seek for your higher self. Put you on some music, put you on some own music, you know, deep own uh, uh, chants, deep own frequency, meditation frequencies and seek for your higher self. And you are going to find a lot that um, you didn't know. All right. All power to the most chakra celestial beings. Peace to you all.